hello everybody my name is Manmeet and today I'm going to show you guys how you can use Ajax in JSF first I will start with why do we need to use Ajax in the web pages the reason why I need to use Ajax is because there are some cases in which we need to change only the part of the page but not the whole page itself so rather than refreshing page again and again we can use Ajax and implement in the application so that we can change that particular part for an example you can see Google search when you type anything Google populate the suggestions by itself Google is not refreshing every time you type so in that place Google is using Ajax so now I will demonstrate you guys a small application like thing uh, in which whenever you type it would be a password and it will show you the strength of your password like it's weak excellent good and etc so here I've already created a new project and it's generally a Java web application project and in that project we have two files the first is the default which creates whenever you create a project and the second is the profile bean in that bean we are going to do our Java code so first start with creating a input tag in which you are going to enter your password so let's start creating with the tab tag sorry my English I'm selecting the input secret because pass password generally comes into input secret tab so just following the rules here the ID I'm going to put it password and the value the value of the password is going to be mapped with the profile bean which the bean file I have created before this is the variable which we are going to create later on let's close the tab and create a closing tab now I'm going to create an output tag where the text is going to display like weak excellent good so let's go ahead and create an output tag here output text value of this will be okay I'm going to store the value in PWD result variable which we are going to create after this thing and the ID would be Okay, let's close the tag here. Give some space here and here. Okay. So now I'm going to create an Ajax inside of the input tag, which is going to take the value from the input tag and render it out in the output tags. Tag, I mean, sorry. So let's start with creating a Ajax tag. I'm going to take the value from the input and for that I need to use the execute I'm putting the password because this is what the input ID is and it changed the value in every key up event And it render the output tag and the output tag value is PWD result let's close the tag okay so we are almost done with the 
index page now so let's go to the profile bean page and here I'm going to first create two variables which are password and I'm assigning it to null string and result again I'm going to assign initialize this variable with null string so let's go quick and create uh, getters and setters for these variables okay so we are done with getters and setters here so in the getters of pwd result we are going to create a small function kind of thing which checks the value so let's do it I'm checking if the password string is empty then we are going to proceed further and here I'm going to check the length of the password if it's smaller than this like if it's smaller than 3 we will do pwd result value to poor else and if the length is smaller than like 7 we will change the value of password result to good oops uh, what I'm getting error here a lot of spelling mistakes are going on last condition superb bracket close here and if the password length is not null then we will display the empty string because we don't want anything to display when we are not inserting anything on the password field okay so let's save it and try to run this app It took a while for NetBean to run. Here is our app and let's try to put something here. See, if I'm putting just two, it shows poor and I'm keep increasing and it goes to excellent.